Hi, today we're going to play a map. It's called Delayed Reaction Air Round Edition by Air Round. The actual original. Oops. Cross. Ah, I can't type. The original version got uh, taken down by Nock because he found a bug but <laughs> um, before I had the chance to play it. But I found this version, so I want to play this. So it looks like it's a mono portal test and uh, cube drops. Does auto respawn? Doesn't really matter because the button's right here in the room. Here's a button that something. Okay. Fizzler on that side opens up. It's kind of interesting. Hmm. Because like my orange portal's already over there. So it's hmm. Also a timer symbol and a dot. Need to get both cubes over there. There's moon over there as well. It's a lot of buttons. And let's just check out what's up here. Can I do that? Yeah. Hope this isn't too loud. I'll nudge it down a little bit. Okay, so there's like 55 signages on this. After a short period of time, it moves the orange portal there. But that short period of time, like... It's only when it moves the orange portal is when they... Like, up here is when there's a period of time. Hmm. It also turns on a laser field over there. And turns off that fizzler laser field all the way over there as well. Hmm. So, I'll do this. Let me just pass the cube up. Hey. Like that. No, like, actually like that. And just plop it on this, see what happens. Oh, what happens to my blue portal, by the way? Oh, I guess replaced. Oh, that's a death fizzler, okay. I didn't know that was a death fizzler. And that happens instantly, right? No, there's a timer on that. There's a timer on all of these, actually. So this whole button is delayed. So if I run... Oh, no! That didn't work. I mean, maybe if I'm quicker, I'd do that, but <laughs> if I'm, you know, I get the feeling that's not the right way to do it. So let's think of something else. Hmm. Gotta involve some other way of, like, what if I already had my blue portal somewhere? And I could just hop down through this portal. Does this portal disappear instantly, by the way? Uh, my portal gas thing isn't really working. So, if I just do this, no, it doesn't disappear instantly. I have a little bit of time. So that could be useful. And what do I need in order to get that, by the way? Ah, okay, so I'd probably want to have this cube up on that button. And then, so that would allow me to shoot a portal in here and get into this room. When I respawn the cube, I could put it on this button, which is going to get through this physically, which would let me get up to the second cube. Cool. So if I do this, head up to the higher platform. I wish there's. I wish this was a bit easier to shoot. Like, could there be another white panel somewhere easier to see? But not a huge deal. So, hmm. And by the way, I have to keep standing on the button, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, and longer arms. I'm hoping I don't have to throw the cube up there. I mean, I probably could, but I don't want to. And if I just let this chill here, that is a death fizzler, so I can't get through it. Can't really get around it. Oh, maybe like this? Oh. Hmm. Oh, duh, like this. Nyeh! So I have just enough time to run through that. Yeah, and then I can do what I said I would do earlier. 
Will it? Nah. Head over here, this allows me to get the second cube. Hi. Oh, it's a hard box. Hmm. So you need to get them both in here. I have a feeling I, I want to do the same thing I just did with this cube. So, how do I do that again? Like that. Should probably quick save, shouldn't I? So now it's just a plain laser field? Yeah. And this is always just a plain laser field at worst. So I think. Hmm. What can I do here? I think this is a this is a regular fizzer, right? I don't know why it has like the death texture on it. Maybe yeah, that's a bug. Yeah, that's a regular fizzling. So, like, obviously it's a laser field, so I can just pass the cube right through, right? I can pass this one through. And... as far as this one... Like, do I want to pass the standard cube through, or the companion cube? I can also get it back if I want. I can just uh, do that, so I don't have to like load a save if I. Well, maybe not. <laughs> I have to get this one back up there. Let's not do that. Let's just commit to doing this. Do this a little bit again. Huh. Like, like I can reach up here now. That would let me, like, I don't know, switch these if I really wanted to. Big deal, right? What about doing this delay time? Is that something interesting I can exploit? I feel like I'm missing something. I don't know what it is, and it's driving me crazy. So let me just think about what I need to do. I need to get both cubes at the end. Right? Hang on. Can I just put one through, like this? Take this down. Put this through. Yeah, that's easy. Okay, just kidding. <laughs> It's a really great map, around. I like it, I think you're improving. <laughs> now, of course, I don't know how much of this map is Nox's original map and how much is Aeron's edition. It did feel kind of tricky. Maybe I was missing something, or maybe I was, like, maybe it really is supposed to be hard, I don't know. I, should pro I probably should have read the description. You probably can't see this on the video. Oh yeah, this is easy difficulty. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know how to feel. I like it. I don't know how much of the thing that I like is Nox's map and how much of the thing that I like is Aeron's map. But, nonetheless, good map. Thumbs up from me. <laughs>